accident alert. That sounds pretty startling, doesn't it? What it actually means, usually, is that your municipality, your county, are on a state of readiness uh, to respond to accidents only in the most extreme situations, and that's because weather-related uh, events have occurred. And normally what that is is icy, snowy weather. And if that happens, what accident alert normally means is you're supposed to exchange information with the driver that you got in the accident with and then follow up later. Well, that's especially troubling if you're hurt in the accident especially if you're hurt and you get transported away from it by an ambulance, or even if you don't, because the information that you exchange is not being investigated on the scene by an officer because there are too many accidents for them to be able to get to. So unfortunately, it puts more of the responsibility back on you to make sure you get all the information that you can. Now, when you exchange this information with someone, as much as possible, get actual documentation. Take pictures of it with your phone on your camera if you have one, and take a picture of the other guy's license plate, if at all possible, and maybe even him, if you can get him when he isn't looking, so that uh, or she isn't looking, so they don't feel too put upon. Because sometimes people claim they haven't been in an accident later. Or they may be giving you false information. So you need to do everything you can to ensure that what you're receiving is the real deal. And I also encourage everyone to follow up, even if you do get the right information, and you're going to the vast majority of the time, Follow up with law enforcement at their office and file what's usually referred to as a counter report, which is a report you fill out to say this is what happened, this is when, this is the information I got, so that there's an official record of it. Sometimes that doesn't happen, and then months later when you're trying to collect something uh, due to your injury or something, there's no official record of it occurring, and perhaps the person you ran into didn't report it to their insurance company, and it becomes a problem. So it's good to follow up with that. Wait a couple of days until the weather clears up. It's a difficult thing to do because you're already in an accident, you may be injured. By the very nature of the situation, it's going to be snowy and icy and these kinds of things. You, the last thing you're concerned about is trying to make sure all the documentation is correct and you have photographs and things like that. But simply because of that situation, it does make it more important. So try and remember to protect yourself when you're out there, especially when law enforcement can't get to you. Talk to you soon.